What's happening with fellow geeks on the internet? I'm Tiana coming at you with another video. This time I've got another unboxing video for you guys. This time uh, it's from Pop Culture, uh, which in Australia is a pop culture uh, store, as you can tell. Uh, obviously, except it's just uh, spelt differently. But um, yeah, so basically it's got, I think, like collectibles from different uh, pop culture, so like Harry Potter, Star Wars, Transformers, Marvel, DC. And so much more. So, yeah, uh, this is uh, based on this is the Transformers one, um, as you can tell by the thumbnail. But uh, yeah, so let's just go ahead and open this because I mean it's just a plain brown box. So I think we can just get straight into it. Yeah, so I ordered a couple of figures. I think I mentioned it in my update video. So, um, yeah. <laughs> if you've seen that, then you will know who is in here. Take that out. So we have Stinger, Crowbar, Jazz, Lockdown, and Crankcase. Or the, uh not quite correct crankcase. So, uh, uh, Go love the box plot. So just set them all up. So as you can see, I've got um, just I was just getting some figures that I hadn't got before, and um, one uh, because I turned them into custom. So I've got Stinger, who I didn't have before, Crowbar because I didn't have that before. So um, yeah, I got another Jazz because the previous Jazz I'm turning into Smoke Screen. Then I also have Lockdown and Crankcase. So yeah, they also sell uh, the Last night, Barricade, World War Two, Bumblebee, uh, Movie One, Starscream, Movie One, Ratchet. So sell a lot of the older figures, which is kind of good because I actually want to get some more Stingers and turn into like Stinger drones or like Stinger bots. So I am planning on getting like at least five more of these just to paint up in the different colors. This one will be Stinger, but the other five will have different colors to be like different drones. Um, yeah, Crowbar, I'm going to customize just as Crowbar from dark of the moon um so i'm not going to really do too much to that video on these two will definitely be coming too jazz i'm just going to touch up the robot mode keeping the silver this time uh i'm planning on getting one more jazz um for two reasons one i want to do a hand swap so he's got uh the two of the open hands uh because i really hate the gripping hands and then the second reason is i got something in mind what to do what i want to do with that figure which i will save uh, which I probably won't do a video on that, but um, that figure is just something I've got in mind for an upcoming project. So um, stay tuned for that. Mostly it's just the second open hand because I hate the gripping hand, but yeah, so I, I will be getting one more jazz figure. Lockdown, I will be customizing, I'll be touching up a little bit, but overall, from what I'm seeing here, I'm loving the paint scheme. And this guy, I'm just going to paint up into my own sort of dread. Is I want to kind of build up the dreads a bit, just have a few dreads, just to act as, I guess, V-cons. But yeah, so I'll have Crankcase, Crowbar, Berserker. The rest I'll have as just random dread bots, basically. Um, or dread cons, I guess, uh, because dread bots are already a character, so dread cons. Uh, so let's go ahead and get each of them out of the packaging. So the Stinger. Uh, so I'm just going to keep the artwork in there. So, figure looks pretty cool. Um, 
I don't know if I'll get KSI boss, uh, KSI sentry. I may, uh, do kind of like a mixed thing. So I'll have like, uh, half of the stinger drones or stinger bots using the KSI mold, like the KSI sentry mold. And, or I might just use six of these and just paint one of them up in the KSI sentry colors. So like black and blue, but, uh, I'll see about that. Um, well, that's not working. I'm gonna go get some scissors. All right, I'm back. So yeah, um, as I was saying, I may get the, a a couple of the KSI sentries, but uh, a lot of them that I have come across are fairly expensive. Uh, so what I might do, I might just do five stinger. Um, get five more stinger drones so I can have the six, which I'll turn into my Stinger cons or stinger bots, whatever I decided to call them. Um, come on, this is pain. Oh yeah, so here he is. A uh, pretty cool figure. Uh, I also got to thank um, my buddy Jared or JS Studios as he did send me some cool images. Like uh, someone's gone in and repainted like the model. It's like the going in on Photoshop and redesigned them, uh, redesigned Stinger. So there was a couple of different, uh, i have to look into that. A couple of different like designs. So and I'm gonna turn a couple of these into that. So there's a blue and orange one, and then there was also a white, green and gold one, which uh, I'll do videos on each of them whenever I customize them. I also wanna do like a gray and black one, a blue and black one, and then uh, maybe a purple and something. I don't know. I'll decide that later. Purple and silver, maybe? Yeah, that'll be cool. Uh, so next up is crankcase. Sorry for the squeaky chair, too. But, uh, yeah. I mean, I know I could just do a cut, but then again, this is an unboxing. I'll get each of the weapons out later. Uh, so I just want to get through this quickly. But man, I absolutely love the dreads from Darker Moon, so I am keen to create some of my own dreads so I can repaint. Um, the vehicle modes I probably won't touch up too much, but um, it'll be more so the robot modes. But yeah. This guy's pretty cool. <clears throat> Next up, Jay. So here we have the figures all out of their packaging. Um, so again, as you obviously can tell, I ended up uh, doing a cut. It was just easier to do the last three. Uh, but yeah, so, um, I'm glad to have another Jazz. This time I'm gonna, um, I will be customizing him. I just won't be going over all that silver. I just only be going over the rebel parts. Singer, I will go over the rebel parts as well. Crowbar, I'll be painting over, like, basically most of him. Everything except for the, uh, the black, uh, vehicle. Uh, this guy, non-crankcase, I'll probably do some other new color scheme. But we'll see. And then lockdown, I'm still deciding whether or not I'll actually do a custom on him or not. Because I, I like the paint job that's on him already. Uh, if I do do a custom paint job on this guy, I do want to get a couple of upgrade stuff. I do want to get the Shadow Raider, Shadow Raider head that's got like the his mask as well as the gun. And they also found a 3D printed spark extractor, which I would like to give him as well. Uh, because uh, I think that will be pretty cool just to finish him off. Uh... Or, you know, I get another uh, lockdown so I can remove this kibble and give him a proper back piece. But we'll see. <clears throat> so, yeah, so thanks for watching this unboxing video. Uh, I don't know if you guys like unboxing videos. Please let me know if you want to see more down below whenever I get more figures in. I personally love filming unboxing videos because I personally enjoy unboxing videos. So, yeah, uh, if you want to see more in the future whenever I get more stuff in, let me know down below. Uh, make sure you check out my Instagrams down below as I always show updates. Uh, the RC Sisters and Smokescreen will be coming out soon. Uh, and then probably my Megatron 2.0 with Dan's uh, Megatron will be coming out soon as well. 
Uh, and then whenever I do more progress on my Red Robin cosplay videos on that will be coming out as well. Minifigures still probably a little bit out. Uh, my loot collection, that should be within a week or two. Uh, but yeah, I mean, figure customs, I don't know what will be coming out next. So yeah, please stay tuned. I got a lot planned. Uh, and then, yeah, I don't know what else to say. So come on, like, subscribe, share for more. And I'll see you guys next time. All right, bye.